दोस्त जिंदगी में नहीं जिंदगी दोस्तों में मिला करती है हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल टेक्निकल टॉक्स का पिटारा आई विश यू ऑल अ हैप्पी फ्रेंडशिप डे टुडे बीइंग द फर्स्ट संडे ऑफ अगस्त वी सेलिब्रेट एज अ फ्रेंडशिप डे एंड समथिंग सिमिलर टॉपिक व्हिच आई हैव ब्रॉट इन टुडे इज कॉल्ड एज डायनेमिक सोर्सिंग बिकॉज वेरी सिमिलर टू हाउ अवर फ्रेंड्स प्ले अ रोल इन अवर लाइफ दो वी डू नॉट ऑब्जर्व इट द सेम वे डायनेमिक सोर्सिंग ऑल्सो works so let's get start get started with the topic called as dynamic sourcing so as you might be aware that why the intelligent cube is being created is to ensure that we do not uh hit the database and bring in your required data directly from your intelligent cube once it is published now if you are directly uh, let's consider that there is a scenario unfortunately i am not able to create this in micro strategy because i have Uh, my micro study license has been expired but let me try to explain you with this diagram consider that this is my grid report where there i have like employees names and the salary so these are my friends name they are million dollar rich friends so i have given their name here so in this if you see the attribute is employee name and the metric is salary so the records are prithik 8 million dollar then nj or dj 9 million dollar so this is pretty simple report that you can see in any of the bi tool and in micro strategy you might have observed that when we create this kind of report by default in most of the cases it's right hand side you will see it's a standard report that means if i run this report it's going to hit the database and the nine steps of execution of report is going to take place do let me know if you do not know i'll try to explain that as well in some other videos so hope you understand how the standard report works now let's consider the scenario where we have the similar kind of setup the thing is that micro strategy already have intelligent cube or the i cube for this okay so this is my intelligent cube which is already there in micro strategy this are my employee names so rithik in short i will say achar and dhananjay in short i will say dj so these are my employee names and you can have another records also but simply to say the purpose i am keeping just two employees okay other dimensions can be say for example their locations so hr always stays in the same location i will say haryana hr itself and uh let me put the salary here i am just putting 8 million and dj salary i am putting into cube as 9 million location for dj i'll not be able to share because in the cube it's not visible anyways uh, our focus is not about that let's talk about the employee and the salary so if micro strategy gets to know that there is a cube which has already this kind of attributes and this matrix which is needed in my reporting so what it will do is it will change this intelligent cube report this standard report will be changed to olap report okay let me put it as olap so hope you know that what is olap that means online analytical processing that means it's going to hit the data from cube it's not going to take it from your database so it's going to be faster so this kind of concept is called as dynamic sourcing all right so this is what we are going to talk about like very similar to how friends they play in our life like they are always there for us and sometimes even you do not know but they are there with you the same thing happens with the dynamic sourcing which happens like instead of hitting the database it fetches the record from your intelligent cube so it's a very much faster compared to going and hitting the database and at the same time uh you are getting the required data immediately it's very faster and also efficient way to do this right and also you do not need to cheese your intelligent cube if at all there is any specific need of course you can do that but if you are not doing that micro strategy is there smart enough to tell you okay let's pull it from this intelligent cube as long as it's matching now there are some restrictions or areas where this dynamic sourcing which doesn't work let's try to figure out them 
So as you know that consolidation and custom groups are something that doesn't work with the intelligent cube. So pretty easy for us to remember that this is not going to work with respect to dynamic sourcing as well. Similarly, if you have freeform SQL where you have written your SQL queries and put into your report or using query builder or anything. So you can in that scenario also it's specific, specific to that report only, right? So in that case also dynamic sourcing is not going to work. Also, I'm not very sure the reason behind, but and not and or not is are the logical operators. If they are available, dynamic sourcing is not going to work. Maybe MicroStudy has been designed in such a way, but I'm not very sure on that. If you're using some kind of pass through functions like apply simple, apply comparison, apply aggregation, those kind of things. Then also, if your metric has all app, uh, sorry, uh, simply uh, apply simple or any kind of pass through function then also it's not going to work so in such scenario what you can do is you create your fact using apply simple and then create a normal metric the simple metric without any kind of pass through functions so that's how you can do dynamic sourcing in, ca in case you have to do any kind of pass through functions otherwise as you know that for performance pers perspective it's always better not to use pass through function and directly use the filters or any kind of other functions readily available in micro study. Similarly, freeform MDX report very similar to pass through functions. And consider that if your matrix has facts with uh, whether the level has been extended or lowered or disallowed, there are the also one scenario where dynamic sourcing is not going to work. Data mars also it will not work at the same time. If you have any report and another report you put in as a report filter in that scenario also dynamic sourcing will be not working rest all scenario dynamic sourcing will be working and i hope you like the video if you like it please do like share and subscribe to this channel thank you have a good day bye bye